<gasps> Pistol! Why does that not fill me with confidence? No, it doesn't. Alright, let's sort out some weapons here. And I'll put you on there. Okay, what the heck's about to happen that I'm gonna need a pistol? Guys, why do we have a pistol here? sophisticated now, huh? So, you found something? Right here. The new guy found it. That right. And everything went cool? Just like gravity. Not exactly. Minerals on Bendy? Kazan. And no Barrett. Not cool. He passed out after the extraction. Woke up saying all kinds of nonsense. Is that right, cowboy? Went on a trip, huh? Uh, how would you know? Well, you could say that the infinite possibilities of the universe are full of everything but coincidences. Alright, that was vague. Uh, I suppose you could call it a trip. <laughs> that fun, huh? Not the most gentle push into the great mysteries of space, but hey... Been there. Look, just hand over the credits, and I'll be happy to never see this thing, or you, ever again. That's why I like you, Lynn. All business. Barrett, the scanners on the frontier are reporting a ship coming in hot from orbit. I really oh, thought I lost. Oh, shit. Barrett? Uh, I need a weapon. Alright, 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 alright. Uh Okay. Um um oh shit 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 okay okay no grab this Alright boys let's do it up let's give them hell Come on, come on. I need some help here. Oh, I missed. Dang it, 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 dang it. Ah. Ow, 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 ow. Die. Oi. Back off. didn't go to well plan oh god we lost what oh fuck we know didn't you 
Jesus. <sighs> oh, we lost a few. Who the hell were they? It was a good plan, it was badly excuses. Can't believe the Crimson Fleet hit us. Crimson who? Alright, Barrett, what the hell just happened? Now that was some fine work on the pressure. You dug up the artifact, right? That means you saw it. The visions? You're coming with me to Constellation. You're part of this now. Uh, what's Constellation? You ever stare up at the stars at night wondering what's out there? Well, that's us. That's where we go. So, what, you're explorers? Wow, okay. Uh, sure, if you can tell me what this artifact of yours is, I'm in. Marvelous. Oh, no, Barrett. No. You think you're just going to take off after the mess you caused? Oh, right. I guess I did just put you all on the Crimson Fleet hit list. How about I stay and I send your Dusty here in my place? I, 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 I know, I know, but he's not some miner anymore, Lynn. Soon as he touched that rock, something changed. Don't tell me you can't feel it. Fine. It's a deal. Get out of here, Dusty. You're on to bigger things. Uh... What about the main? Do you not need me? Do you not need my help? Now that we've been attacked... Oh, we've got to pack up and move on. Argos will come for the rest of us. You get going. Alright. Well, thanks for everything, Lynn. Just go. Before I say something I regret. Well, now that that's settled... Vasco! Get him to the lodge. No deviations unless absolutely necessary, okay? Protocol Indigo. Indigo? Again? Very well. Oh, and hey, take this. You'll find it very useful out there. And it even tells the time. It's a watch. Okay. Hey, look at that. The watch fits you perfectly. Now, questions? Thousands. But apparently I only have four. And one of them is not, what is the Crimson Fleet, but just why the Crimson Fleet after you, so we'll start there. They're just following the loop, like pirates do. And I have something of a reputation mm -hmm. as a loot collector. A man after my own heart, eh? Okay. So they're a pirate group. Uh, what exactly did we dig up? That, my friend, is the million credit question. And Constellation can find the answer. With your help. Alright. Uh, did we know the answer this already? See, that's the problem with the settled systems. Too easy to take everything for granted. While everyone else is busy playing politics, we're the ones braving the unknown, charting the vastness of space. Without us, the galaxy is just a big room with the lights turned out. Hmm. You, uh, you giving me a ship? Technically, it's not even mine. Consider it alone. Vasco will keep you on course. Besides, I'm making an exception since you can tell Constellation about that vision you had. Thinking it over? Good instinct. Uh, why send me, shouldn't you go? Come on. You're really not at all curious about that light music show you experienced? Oh, yes why I am. Why it only affected you? Because if you didn't notice, we've all been handling it since with no problem. The way I see it, Constellation needs that artifact, but they also need you. This mystery is only getting bigger each step we take. 
and you're part of it now. All right. I'm in. And Vasco, don't let him break my ship. <laughs> my ship, no. We're still in one piece. Oh, God. Let I'm me just have a... Uh... Hey, you got any good hits in? It's not every day we get to cut anything other than rocks. This attack yeah. better not be coming out of our pay. Well, I ain't coming out of my pay. I'm leaving. All right. Let's go. Nice. Nice. All right. Board the ship. Captain Picard, I assume you know how to fly a Class A starship. As Barrett likes to say, it's as easy as learning to ride a bike. I will attempt to boost the shields, just in case there are any difficulties. Oh, that was awesome. You called me Captain Picard. <laughs> nice. All right, let's uh, clean this place up. Okay, what's this? That is personal sleep. You know the drill, Vasco. Protocol Indigo means no deviations, no distractions, no dalliances, in short, no fun. Unless, as strictly defined by Sarah, that deviations, distractions, and dalliances are completely necessary in getting this fine vessel, the Discovery Class Starship Frontier, back home in one piece. I guess I'm still technically borrowing it from Constellation, even if I have no intention of actually giving it back. <laughs> All right, uh, log. Personal log two is over here. Well, hey there. I rate pirates. Looks like you <laughs> finally did it. Boarded my ship, scrapped my bot, ripped those beautiful brown eyes out of my adorably cherubic face. And then you discovered the guy you had pegged as a treasure hunter doesn't actually have any treasure. Not anymore. It's true. I may have had a pricey trinket or two when I evaded your sorry asses at Kumazi. But brother had to buy fuel. So you get nothing. Except my ghost. Cause I am gonna haunt your asses till the end of your days. Which for a Crimson Fleet pirate is about what? Uh, another week? <laughs> Alright, and log three. Oh, I'd kill for some chunks right now. First stop when I get home. But I really need to get better about packing snacks for these long hauls. Some rhubarb boom pop. Maybe some cereal. Irvin always made the best trail mix. Added in little marshmallows for stars. <laughs> I miss that. Hey, Heather. Hit the partner at some point. Hey, right, let's sort this mess out. All right, there we go. Okay. I'm just gonna have a quick rest, Vasco. I'm absolutely shattered after that fight in a day's work at mining. Let's get a couple of hours in here. For oh, much better. Oh. 
Ugh. Do we really have to leave these, um... These... Stuff lying around here. Uh... Dirty coffee cups. Uh, yeah, we'll store those. Alright. Shields ready. The rest is up to you. Let's go. I always wanted to do this, so uh just just humor me a second, Vasco. Five four three two one I could use all help, Vasco. Alright, uh, use, da -da -da, switch between systems and allocate power. Can I not just use, yeah, I can, I can, I can use, I can use that, right, alright. So when you turn your ship there. Okay, so when you've got your your power setting in the middle and you turn, you don't lose as you don't lose a lot of speed. But if I'm going full throttle and I turn, let's turn our attention to I lose shields. a lot of speed. Try adjusting. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna try to burst. Notice more boost. power increases their strength. Shields protect the ship from hull damage without a hull of be vaporized. Shield health is displayed in the lower right. Hull damage is below it. Okay, got it. You've proven an adequate pilot. Are you familiar with ship combat tactics? Because that's a crimson oh! ship bringing its hey. weapons to bear. See ya. Congratulations on surviving your first Starship assault, Captain. We should search the wreckage for spare parts and other salvage. You will need to fly close to it before we can access the remains. Uh, press that to... Uh, how close did he get? Oh, there we go. Uh, 
Alright, Vasco Nova. Two more Crimson Fleet ships are jumping into our location, Captain. Oh. That's not good. information about the environment lets you scan the planet for resources and helps you discover key landing sites rotate the planet until a quick research lab map icon is in view then select the map icon and land okay all right then we can scan wow okay we'll get what do we have here we'll get lead we've we'll got iron argon which I believe is a gas. And we have some water. Water. We also have alkin. Alkins. I don't know what that is. Silver. Neon. All right. Well, I guess it's time to put this bird on the ground. for this right now so let's um hold on uh, hold on hold the phone let's um so some of those all right i think we're gonna store that as well i'm not i'm not a melee man I prefer my range Right. Alright. Let's... Close that. And... Alright, let's... Oh! Scan creatures, materials and plants. Each unique item scan progresses 
Your survey data of the planet. Complete survey data. The completed survey data can be sold for credits. Oh, nice. The scanner mode also unlocks additional features such as building outposts and using social skills like diplomacy and intimidation. Okay. Eh. Right, let's scan some stuff. Get lead. We've got this iron. Alright, cool. So when you scan it, it's when you've not scanned it, it's blue. When you scan it, it's green. Is that how this works? Or does it go green when you're finished scanning it? Because that's still blue and I've not scanned that yet. But I've scanned another one. See? Yeah, okay. So if it's blue, it still needs to be scanned, basically. Oh, hello. Ooh, structure over there. What's that? Neon. Nice. I have two things left to find. For uh, resources. Yeah, well, what's that? Something natural, that's what that is. Oh, T blue. I think I'll have a... I'm not sure what that is. I think it's a gas. Which I'm guessing means I need to find a vent. Creek grazer. I think it's a creek grazer. Trilobite. Easy big fellas. Easy big fellas. Nope. Ow. No, no, you don't. You appear to be prioritizing your deaths over your own survival. Alright, are you gonna die? Thank you. Alright. There was a, um. There he is. Did I scan this guy? No. Uh, well, at least the trailer bites don't fucking start biting your ankles. That's, that's good. That's when you piss it off, you're killing it, dude. Okay, yeah, we're done with those things. Is there, an there is another one. Oh, 
Okay, we're still looking for one more thing. Aha! Nice. Engineer scan more trailer mates. Let's go! Did you piss those things off? You dead? You pissed them off? Hey! Look at that! Okay. Each skill also unlocks a challenge. Complete the challenge and then spend a skill point to rank up the skill. Basic skills rows below are locked until you spend the maximum number of skill points in that category. Alright, cool. Um, I think I want to upgrade my scanner first. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Let's let's because this is probably gonna be important. So let's do that. Oh shit. Try and save the ammo. I don't have a lot of it. Silver. Oh, yeah, I'm done scanning our stuff. And there is. Healing. Thing. What is that wormy thing? Has a heat leech in it? Yes. Okay. Nutrients. So see, let's let's leave them to it for now. Uh, those grazers are abundant. Get back on track, Vasco. Okay. There we go. Down there. Right. Hello, trailer bites. Give them a white birth, dude. Don't annoy them, they won't annoy you. What the heck was 
that? Omega, the last days. Uh, the following is the opening of Camille Flammarion's Fla 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 Flammarion's Flam Flammarion's Flammarion's Camille Flammarion's. 1894 work Omega, the last days of the world, in which a comet is set to collide with the Earth in the 25th century, and people must come to terms with the end of the world and what that actually means. Omega, the last days of the world, chapter 1. The magnificent marble bridge which Unites the Rue de Rue de Rins with the Rue de Louvre and which lined with the statues of celebrated scientists and philosophers emphasize the monumental avenue leading to new Portico P Portugal leading to new Portugal of the Oh Port no for God's sake it's Puerto Rico Port Port No it's no Puerto Rico Portico I give up <laughs> My god that was full of words I don't know right No book Alright, anything else useful here? The gravity parad paradigm paradigm? The gravity paradigm. Truth is what our scientists don't know back then would fill volumes. The focus of course was the wormholes and not only creating but maintaining a stable and sustainable Einstein Rosen Rosenbridge. That was the goal, the end point no one had even considered that maybe that was just the beginning. When he looked at Grav Drive when we look at grav drive technology and the ease at which we fold space and travel light years and seconds it's sometimes easy to forget the impossibility of what we've achieved oh so that's how grav drive drives work am i reading that right is it a combination of a stable wormhole and Einstein's Einstein Rosenbridge. Huh. Okay. 
interest in where did I, I just picked up something I need to not just grab everything I see if it ain't interesting and it ain't useful we'll leave it behind bad jokes for bad people are bad people bad jokes too why'd the chicken cross the road uh what's a chicken Oh my god. No knock. Who's there? Planet. Planet who? If I throw a party, will you help me, help me plan it? Oh. Cladding mercenaries say to a woman, I've been hired to kill you and I always get the job done. Woman says, can't we talk about this, son? <laughs> okay, that one's good. How do you keep an idiot in suspense? Okay. How do you get a free star collective hick out of a tree? Wave. <laughs> Lewis Loop Looper's Bad People, Bad Jokes Volume 2 is the follow up to his original work and just like its predecessors has become a cult hit. Alright then. Curious. These are United Colonies markings, but we are in Free Star Collective space. It then stands to reason that this was once a secret UC facility. Okay. That. Well, that's worth quite a bit, actually. Let's pick those up. Scumbag! That damn thing nearly gave me a heart attack. Oh yeah, that's a long one. Right, okay. I don't think there's much else here. I don't know why, I just want to have those my life chunk by chunk. My life chunk by chunk. I was very young, only seven years old, when I realized humans are animals, smart animals. Sure, but still animals. You give us food, we'll eat it. We want it to taste good and we want it to stop our hunger. Those two things, that's what's most important. After that, sure, some people want their food to be really healthy, as the experts say, and some want it to be pretty, but most people, they just want to cram something into their face, and that's when the concept of chunks was born. So begins the 120 page autobiography of Fred Blom Blombard, founder of Chunks Food franchise. Hmm. Yeah. Nope. Nothing too useful here. Oh, hello. Spoke too soon.
Mondays, am I right? Yes, you are. Everybody hates Monday. History of zero biology. The the dissection of Doctor Lord's last find revealed a creature that was just as she suspected. Based on its outward appearance, an evolution of the make microscopic hydrothermal worm but her research also struggled it also suggested a species that evolved in distinct stages possibly growing significantly as it did so the question now remains which version of the creature did Dr Lord dissect and what maximum size could it possibly achieve? The subsequent passage deals with Nelson's fasc fascination with the predatory wildlife of some unknown world. Okay. Some interesting stuff there, Vasco. What have we got here? Ooh, used in craft. Take it. Why am I walking around? Suddenly, off. I've not came across any any persons yet, but something tells me we may be getting close. These pirates have got to be in here somewhere. And that least just gonna give us away. What the heck? Dude, seriously. I know another robot that was just like you would walk into everything, send it scattering, and then blame me. What? We are not alone. 